In a remarkably short span of just 30 years, the internet has reshaped our lives in ways we could have never anticipated. It has revolutionized the way we create and share research, how we communicate across the vast expanse of our globe, and how we conduct our daily transactions. But this is certainly not the end of our digital evolution, rather the beginning. Web3, often referred to as the next generation of the internet, is a concept that's been gaining significant attention in recent years. It promises a digital landscape that is user-controlled, private, and decentralized. This new iteration of the internet is built on a variety of innovative technologies, including blockchain, peer-to-peer -peer networks, decentralized storage, and identity management. These technologies aim to create a more equitable and user-centric online world, where individuals have control over their data and interactions. However, as with any pioneering technology, this new frontier is not without its challenges. Scalability, or the ability of a network to handle a growing amount of work, is one of the most significant hurdles facing Web3. As we've seen with the rise of blockchain trading card games like Cross the Ages, the demand for Web3 applications is growing at a rapid pace. This surge in demand is putting a strain on the current infrastructure, which often struggles to handle the volume of transactions. This can lead to slow transaction speeds and high costs, which can deter users and hinder widespread adoption. For instance, Ethereum, a leading blockchain platform, is actively trying to solve this issue. They are developing zero-knowledge Ethereum virtual machines, ZK EVMs, which promise limitless scalability. This technology aims to increase the capacity of the Ethereum network, allowing it to process more transactions quickly and at a lower cost. Usability is another significant challenge facing Web3. While Web3 applications offer many benefits, they can often be difficult to use for those unfamiliar with blockchain technology. This can create a barrier to entry for many potential users. For example, Web3C, a solution developed by the Web3 development company Blockstars.tech, is trying to reinvent Web3 by adding a search engine to it. This aims to make Web3 more accessible and user-friendly. However, even with these advancements, there's a need for more user-friendly interfaces and applications in the Web3 space. Companies like Coindash are emerging as partners for decentralized applications, blockchain protocols, and NFT marketplaces. They're helping to enhance their digital presence and drive growth, making these platforms more accessible to a broader audience. Regulation is perhaps the most significant challenge facing Web3, though. The decentralized nature of Web3 applications makes them difficult to regulate. This has led to concerns about cryptocurrency, money laundering, and terror funding. These concerns have led to calls for more robust regulatory frameworks to ensure the safety and security of users. For instance, Japan's Prime Minister, Fumio Kashida, recently signaled that the country plans to improve the environment for Web3. They are taking user protection into account while also improving the environment for utilizing Web3 tokens. This shows a recognition of the potential of Web3, but also an understanding of the need for appropriate regulation. In conclusion, while Web3 has the potential to revolutionize the internet as we know it, it faces significant challenges in terms of scalability, usability, and regulation. These challenges need to be addressed to ensure the successful implementation and widespread adoption of Web3. However, with ongoing developments and innovations in the field, we can expect these challenges to be addressed in the near future. The potential of Web3 is enormous, and with the right approach, it could fundamentally transform our digital lives. Would you be interested in using Web3? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button so you're always in the know.